Hey everybody, this is Roy Hill from Design in the Raw. In today's screencast, I'm going to show you guys how to integrate BBPress with WordPress. BBPress is a bulletin board forum system created by the same folks that created WordPress. Um, there are two ways to um, install BBPress. One way is to keep everything separate, um, separate user tables and separate admin tables in the database side. And the other way is to integrate the two where the user database table and the admin database table are shared. Um, the pros of that is uh, if a user logs into your BBPress, they're also logged into your WordPress. So they do not need to log out or to change their account or to create another account. Um, they are basically seamless because um, WordPress and BBPress are now linked and sharing the same tables and that goes for admin as well so you do not need to have two different admin accounts to administer both um, sites and a lot of people like to put uh, BBPress within the WordPress site to be in the same theme although I'm not going to talk about how to theme um, BBPress to be seamless with WordPress today but I will talk about the technical backgrounds of it. Um, from here, I assume that you already have a WordPress site, a testing WordPress site installed. Um, so I'm just going to go straight over to BBPress here. Um, just type in bbpress.org and you can just download it from here. The latest one is version 1.0.2. Just click the link here. Remember where you saved it, of course. Um, I already have one here on my desk, sitting here on my desktop. Okay, so to prepare the BBPress database, I need to create the actual database first within the database um, MySQL. So let me just log in here as root password one two three four, and just simply create a database named BB press okay now what you want to do is actually before I go and install it I have to extract it don't I okay go to your BB press you want to extract all your files within your WordPress site so I'll go ahead and open up your WordPress folder or directory wherever, wherever you have it and let's create a new folder called let's name it forums and within the forums you want to paste all your BBPress files okay and go ahead and close out these two and now you want to navigate over to your forums URL and you should get the BBPress installation um, page it looks fairly similar to the WordPress so just hit go to step one database name I think we named it BBPress user root pass one two three four that could be different for you guys and just to click show advanced settings just to check it out and everything looks good save database configuration file go to step two and check the checkbox at integration settings and check the checkbox for add cookie integration settings okay WordPress address URL. This is basically where you have your WordPress site at. So for my, actually I need this HTTP. For my address is localhost WordPress. For you it might be something different, but just make sure you point it to where your WordPress site is. Blog address is the same. Okay, here. WordPress auth cookie key. Okay, I'm going to show you where to get that what you want to do is you want to go into the folder of your WordPress and find the file name wpconfig.php you want to open that up 
I'm using Notepad++, but you can use whatever you know text editor you want. And if you scroll down to here, where it says authentication unique keys, okay, there's there should be a URL here, uh, secure URL here. So basically, you copy this link here up to the last um, forward slash. Go to your browser, create a new tab, paste in the URL, hit enter. You should get four defined keys. So copy those. Go back to your file and you want to replace these four defined uh, entries here. Just copy it over it and save it out and just keep this page open because you will need it. So here, uh, back in the BBPress installation, we're asking you for auth cookie key. You want to copy and paste this string here. Copy everything in between the single quotes. Paste it here. The cookie salt you can skip because it will just pull it automatically later. So here it asks for secure auth cookie key. That's this here, where it says secure auth key. So copy everything in between the single quotes. And paste it here. And same thing for cookie salt, just skip that. Go to logged in cookie key. And that's where it says logged in key here. And do the same thing. and paste and again cookie salt just skip that and you can just close out of this one here okay and then check at user database integration settings and here the prefix make sure it's the same as um, how you install WordPress uh, it could be different um, I just left, left it as default so I'm just gonna leave it as default here as well and uh, WordPress MU, just skip that. Show advanced database settings, check that. Okay, here's basically asking you what database, what is the name of the database for the user table. And, and most people, they put BBPress here or where they install the BBPress database, which is not correct. If you want to um, integrate the two, you want to actually put the name of the database for your WordPress site. So here you will put WordPress, assuming that's the name of the database for your WordPress site. And user database, uh, user, um, you want to put root, in my case at least. For you it might be a little bit different depending on your uh, database username. One, two, three, four, host. Most of the time it's local host. Um, character set UTF-8 and you could skip this character collation and you could skip these two last fields too and go ahead and say save go to step 3 and give it a site name just put BB press for now um, okay leave the URL key master username I just select admin first forum name um, testing forum safe site settings complete the installation and then if you have any errors it will show you a little red box like this and you can check this box to show what happened and here it just says your email was not sent which is okay because my email uh, server settings is not set so at this point you're pretty much done um, and let me just show you if you go to WordPress forums and you log in as um, instead of um, WP-admin you put BB-admin and you get the login screen for BB press and I'm going to use the same admin password or name and password 
as I did for WordPress. Login. And this is the back end interface or dashboard for your BB Press. So if I, let's say if I went to my WordPress um, dashboard, admin dashboard, you can see I just went right in without um, even logging in because I'm already logged in from a BB Press side and the cookie just remembers my username and password because it is linked because it's sharing tables so that is how you integrate the two